Marseille headed north to Clermont, eager to pick up where they left off in midweek with their rousing Coupe de France victory over Paris Saint-Germain. At the same time, they were looking to get back on track in the league, though, after their defeat at home to Nice last time out, which had ended a strong unbeaten run and seen them slip back to eight points behind the Parisians at the summit. Clermont were also in need of bouncing back, having seen a pair of 2-1 victories followed up by a run of three games without a goal, though two of those were 0-0 draws. The pair had to be patient with kick-off at the Stade Gabriel Montpellier, delayed by almost an hour after incidents outside the ground. When the action did get underway, it was the hosts on the attack, Mohamed Cham, testing Paul Lopez from range. Down the other end, OM's new signing, Rizlan Malinowski, also getting in a sighter. The Ukrainian picked up his first goal in France last weekend and then grabbed another in the cup win over PSG. Clermont thought they'd taken the lead midway through the first half when Grejom Kay followed up to score after Lopez had parried another cham shot. However, Kay was offside when the initial shot was taken. VAR saw the goal chalked off. Instead, it was Marseille who were handed the chance to take the lead just before the break. A deflected Malinowski free kick. It's well saved by Mori Dio in the Clermont goal. Another VAR check showed that the shot had come off the arm of Cham in the wall. And eventually, a penalty was awarded. Alexi Sanchez, the man to step up, making no mistake in converting from the spot in the 44th minute. Visitors lost Samuel Gigo to injury right on half time. Joey appeared to turn an ankle in painful fashion whilst blocking an Ayman More attempt. But Igor Tudor and Co. will otherwise have been in good spirits after a decent first half showing and a one goal lead at the break. Into the second half and Isaka Bore brought on as part of a triple change. The substitute very quickly came close, seeing a reflected effort hit the bar just four minutes after the restart. Marseille kept up the pressure. Jordan Veretout testing Dior's reflexes with a curling effort. And the second goal did finally come late on. Jonathan Claus crossing for Sanchez, whose initial header was tipped onto the bar by Dior before the Chilean bravely nodded in the rebound. Former Barcelona and Arsenal man was dropped to the bench last weekend as new signing Vitinha made his debut against Nice. He returned to score the opener and star in the cup win over PSG and now a brace to secure victory here after 13 goals for the season. 2-0 the final score. Marseille make it five consecutive away wins and that's now eight victories and a draw in their last ten in the league. The gap to PSG reduces to five points.